like the third cast uh, of the series there will be more ahead today we are going to be talking specifically about the esports uh, scene as well as tournaments competitions and that kind of thing so ez, ez volt a felvetett felvetett ugye egy sneaky üdvözlő mindenkit uh, Uh, ez ugye a harmadik része ennek a podcastnak, és lesz még egy pár. És ugye ebben a, ebben a podcastban ugye az e-sport és a verseny lesz a fő topik. Ugye itt van Geeks, Iron Fist és Sigma, de hogy Iron Fist és Sigma felhagy cserélve. <laughs> Igen, a felvett cserébe látom. Ugye üdvözlök még mindenkit. Próbálj gyorsan megoldani ezt a kis marőt. Competitions. I know you do a lot of evasion stuff. Um, talk to us a little bit about that. You want the real yeah. Sigma or the? Most ezt Nikki azt mondta, hogy veszélyen a Sigma egy kicsit, mert úgyis a versenyek az ő asztala. Amíg ugye megcsinálja ezt a kis malőt. My impressions are terrible as is. I've been practicing my geek save with the beard for the longest night. I now have to do a Sigma as well. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, Iron Fist, you just said that you guys have geeks at Pro Bay. You tell us in the first time you're Sigma, because I'm not so sure. Um, well, I mean, Iron Fist uh, is very, very, very involved in evasion with me. I, Sneaky, you know everything that goes on behind yeah. the scenes in evasion. I know that you're super busy, but uh, you definitely stay up to date on what we're doing. Uh, so I started the battles what almost three years ago. We're coming up on three years. Yes, evasion. Yes, evasion. Most of the time, yes. Into this huge thing, and we knew it needed a home, so we created evasion and the server and the website, and and really stepped up our game to make sure that the community. Uh, and you must be. You have to go to the server. Board of the one server. Minden más egyéb. Are entertained. So this season we are offering solos and duos like we normally do but we're also adding trios to it so ebben a a szezonban uh, solo duo és triók is lesznek az evasionon realizing that they have some talent in in running these events it's not an easy job so hats off to everybody that's stepping up to take part in that és nagyon köszönni azoknak a munkáját akik ugye ezeket az eventeket uh, Segítünk neki megcsinálni. Ugye a BSG-nek is. Szerintem nagyon köszönöm a BSG-nek, mert nagyon sokat támogatják őket, és a, a emiszerik és serpek is elég sokat támogatják az Evasion eventeket. Their involvement in esports and and competitions, because I know that uh, Iron, for instance, you are part of organizing the uh, the hunt, uh, the organization behind the uh, the hunt tournament, um, and Geeks, you've had some previous experience as well. Uh, so yeah, terms of Iron, ugye, a hunt tournamentnek az egyik ilyen alapítója Geeks is részt vett egy pár versenyen. Some you may not know, but uh, Geeks A was playing Hearthstone before he actually joined. Uh, mm -hmm. Uh, before he joined the Tarkov community. Is it Geeks or Evan Hearthstone yet? So Tarkov, but it's not too much fun, is it? No boy. Some of uh, some of the definitely notable organizations and tournaments around the Tarkov community uh, in its current state, for sure. I mean, we've got the Italian competitions um, with Enzo's organization as well. But, uh, as Enzo, uh, Enzo serves you as well as Vashinkin. Doing something uh, very soon. Uh, so stay tuned, uh, stay tuned for that. We've got Scooey's uh, organization, Scooey's Factory. That's um, that's the German. Ah, uh, so a name, a name of the name is Scooey's Factory. Jaka, that the Scooey, as a Ukrainian service, is in it. Very well put together, and uh, the production value is, is absolutely great. Of course, like I just mentioned, uh, the hunt, which is primarily an emissary. Azt mondja, hogy a Hunt, amit uh, Iron Fist csinál, uh, Van Deltának az EFT ligája a másik. Tehát rengeteg az új verseny a srácok. Um, we've got some uh, other regional events like the Korean LAN 
És vannak uh, ilyen regionális eventek is. A koreai LAN az egyik. Ami nem valószínű. Tehát, ami még mindig tervezés alatt áll, hogy a, gyakorlatilag a Covid helyzetnek köszönhetően. Tudnak egy csilei versenyelés, aminek a Low Cost Tarkov, tehát ilyen alacsony községedik Tarkov a neve, mint olyan. És a Geeks-et kérdezi, hogy milyen, milyen az ő, hogy, hogyan éli meg ezeket a versenyeket Tarkova kapcsolatosan? Mind a két Twitch Rivals-on játszott Geeks? És ugye az első Punisher-on is játszott. És ugye nem, nem csak pvp nem valami task orientált is, és vannak PvP és task, taskok is. És nagyon élvezi, mert, vagy nagyon élvezi őket, mert mindegyik egy kicsit ér, tehát érdekesebb, mindig másabb egy picivel. It's hard for like it's easy for me to be like you know what I'm just gonna go there and have some fun and then when the day comes I'm like I'm gonna win this mother effort like you know what I mean? Igen, és azt mondja Giggs, hogy úgy áll hozzá, hogy jó, hát csak oda menjünk, aztán érezzük jó munkat, és akkor majd lesz valami, és utána nap végén viszont már ezzel menjünk, akkor nyerjük meg. Ez a mentalitás. Perfect. And what about you, Ryan? You've participated in quite a few events yourself. Um, how has it been for you? Maybe name some events. Yeah, I, I've again, I, I've taken part in um, Evasion. That's how, well, the main reason why I started volunteering and taking part in terms of the organization. Mm, és ugye, Iron ugye az Evasion-ben játszott, és um, uh, ezért jelentkezett is arra, hogy tudja őket segíteni. At the, the, at the time, it was kind of like, everybody gets burnt out with Tarkov. You know, we have these like dips and troughs in terms of playing the game too much, you know, and you're doing the same thing over and over. And everybody's feedback the first time they take part in evasion is that was the most fun I've had in Tarkov because it is such a. Yeah, as you're saying, it's a very strange thing. Nobody cares about me as a Tarkov, but it's quite as well as the first one. Evasion is such a a a vis hang that I'm with Tokyo. You want to get these events? Because you're fair, fish. Take a little bit of the event. The PVP, the looting. Um, you know, it lends yourself to if you your your game knowledge um, adds to it as well. So I've taken part in Punisher as well. Again, not my forte, but I like to challenge myself when it comes to that side of things. Ja, Punisher is játszott annyira, nem az ő asztala, de elvesztem. Ja, Rivals events finish in first and third with test and and in taking part in the NA one, but it's that mix of objective based and PVP which really does. Csak Twitch Rivals és az elsőben elsők lettek a más a következő meg a harmadik. Especially Enzo's Winter Cup, that was one that really did because the amount of planning that our team went into actually before the actual tournament itself was half of the work. The actual Playing the raid was almost a small fraction of it. It's just that you guys have a fair case for it. It's what the Geeks are going to be watching. It's not a, not as much as the raid went through. It's just a very minimal case. Of course, this podcast is live here now. There are people who are translating this live as well. So do keep that in mind when we explain whatever. We just point point our best and give them both. We point us when it's Nikki. The top nine of one. Ez az egész lefordítva, tehát egyszerre azt hiszem talán 5 vagy 6 nyelven megy most éppen az live-ban. Ez kind of grounded as we can, but nonetheless, for me personally, I've taken, I definitely have taken part in some competitions, but I think the older I get, the less competitive or the less kind of interest I have. Ezt nekik azt mondja, hogy ő is játszott egy pár ilyen versenyben, de minél idősebb annál, annál kevésbé érdekli őket. And the back end of the whole thing, and this is. It's not the mucus. Yeah, so clever and elegant. Actually, why today's topic should be not well, not only, not only because of me, of course, but there is a general sense, I believe, in the community currently 
where people are looking to uh, get a bit of a break from the regular day to day, just like you said, Ian. I think. Yes, uh, yeah, uh, te, pont pont ezért az a topiknak a pont ez a podcast témája, mert elég elég azt látják, hogy nagyon sokan próbálnak kilépni a napi napi grindból és valami más csinálni, vagy valami valami más előállni. Valami, ami, ami, egy, ami egy új, ami, ami másabb, mint az átlag tarkó, amit játszol. És úgy gondolom, hogy nagyon sokan keresnek ilyet. Ez szerintem ez igaz. And more prominent, uh, there will be more of these types of events um, and competitions and things like that. Um, we're actually currently just we're waiting because uh, it looks like Nikita is actually going to be joining us slightly. Okay, so uh, because I want to, we want to take a little bit of time, but we're not going to see Nikita is before the chat goes on the podcast. Maybe get a little bit of a word about. Um, we had 12.9 uh, which uh, dropped on the 15th of last month if i'm not mistaken right so today is the 31st so yesterday uh, last month about halfway through, February, we had uh, pain, 12, 9, not, a, not two months later six weeks later which is out now uh, everybody who's playing target who's Remotely interested in Tarko should most likely, or you will most likely know about uh, about 12.10 and uh, what it has brought. Uh, we're not yeah, going to go into the past notes, but I'm going to go into the past notes. But I'm going to go into the past notes. But I'm going to go into the past notes. But I'm going to go into the Have you had a chance to play yet? Yeah, Mi a kedvenc uh, része is? Geeks-et kérdezi először? It was really good. You know, uh, I like that the endurance was nerfed. You, you know, if you get God spawn on shoreline, you're not going to be able to run straight to the back on one bar anymore. Uh, I also like, like one of the biggest things, I know it's stupid. Geeks azt mondja, hogy neki a, a nerf tetszik, tehát az endurance nerf. When you put something on the flea market, when you press add offer, that 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 box is now to the left so you can see all the prices like that was one of the things ugye a free market ha hogy éppen alatt szalamit a konstant a doboz a bal oldalon és ez is tetszik neki én látod hogy körülbelül mik az árak I'm really liking the new gun the STM I think it is nem tetszik neki az új puska az ST az STM carbine had a blast with it yesterday it was such it's such a goofy fun gun that it was perfect thing to add right now because it's just like kind of like it's like a like a fun push cuz i guess it you know you would let like tint uh this is implement and you can make the recoil on it like 22 or something ridiculous and it it's just so some cat to let it who's recoil at the time i wanted them and play with your boys and everyone with but other than that like you know i know a lot of people weren't happy with some of the interchange lighting i didn't really notice that i played interchange but i didn't notice it or so you just you just you like it as a center so when i can each other mega league we guess i want them to have a taste rest now so now so now so did i'm up you know we weren't expecting to add too much to it and it was it was just a, a solid patch no issues you know it ran really smooth the game runs i think very smooth there was no issues with them having to fix things it's sending top patch you can then that no one you know no one you know one meant a passion because of the kid why i think again you i guess your foot two in ten hours that i played yesterday some people are saying they're hearing it constantly i don't i'm not getting that at all could be okay to audio bug bug got to like is it uh these are all out of time i know you're busy but uh yeah, so uh, I actually haven't had a chance to play. Today will be my my first time. My in-laws are in town. You guys know I typically play every day, but my in-laws are in town. Sigma még nem játszott vele, mert a hát az anyósék ott vannak. So I'm just going kind of like lurking in people's channels to see what their opinions are. Csak igazából ezt hogy lurkol, ugye más csatornák van, hogy megnézzük kinek mi a véleménye róla. I know you, I saw you playing yesterday. How was it? I mean, the the main highlight that people were picking out is the rain sound being reduced that that was such a hot topic um i've had half a raid in rain and it does feel quieter 
Um, hogy ugye mindenki a, a, az eső hangját mondja, és azt mondja, hogy ténylegesen nem, mint hogy a halka az eső. Tehát, hogy jó. Raiders and scavs not shooting when they go prone, they still dolphin dive, but they no longer want tapped in the face when they do. I actually like... Ez jó. Itt a Raiders és a scavek már nem lőnek le, tehát nem, nem dropshotolnak, hanem ugyanúgy le dolphin dive-olnak, tehát ugyanúgy ugye elé dugrik, de nem lő le egy, egyből. And just voice lined, and I was like, oh, there must be... They've definitely tweaked something there. Um... The new items look fun as well. Uh, Rashala's boys look to be uh, spawning with the uh, tan slick, which is uh, spices things. Rashala, Rashala, many any you need to get a, a, a tan slick slick cap spawn on. That is Rahomok slick cap. Spent more time modding it than I actually got to use it because of how long my raid lasted. But I'm looking forward to my best. So yeah, I know this. I said I'd like to try the 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 they just took a nose dive, like CPU fans, CPUs, like so many things took a nose dive yesterday, and I still can't find this ratchet wrench that's going for like a million rubles right now. But that's saying that the S X is like lefelé, lefelé in the other side, and there's a lot of things in there. Yeah. Uh, CPU, not CPU, uh, CPU fan, not. But I think maybe just one of the wrenches that I found that just took a nose dive. Specific, I think, is the the thermal rework. It's definitely the thermal rework. Hold on, I need to send a quick link to a special somebody. I should not get this in time. The the flea market is just. Have you guys noticed that? Oh, there we go. Didn't you stress? Hey, hey. Hello, Nikia. I get them very quick. Yeah, to be zakino. V Discordě. Rys, oroslo nem tudok fordítani gyerekek. Oroslo nem fog menni. Bez surprise, u nás my už v live. Jak pomíš, jak prošel raz? Discord sneaky. Já. All good. Vodka. A to z hozera vodka, to stále fordíjí. All good. But yeah, the the thermal rework, I think, is is. My favorite part. All right, chat. I think it's the most interesting thing about the site. I think it's the most interesting thing about the site. Himself. Hold on, hold on. Get your seat, you're the third thing. His camera should be popping up anytime soon. Go on. Let's switch it back. What? And there he is. Welcome in chat. Welcome Nikita to. So how you make it, Nikita? Is in Taiwan? Hey. Can you hear me? Yep. 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 Nice. Hello, guys. Unfortunately, I don't have much time. I have like half an hour, so. Could be a feel what I am almost. Yeah, I don't. I don't. Don't want to say again the same things that I said. That's okay. Back and and everything. So you, if you have any questions or something for myself, you go ahead. Feel free to ask, and yeah. We do. You guys should ask for the judge. The one we make questions, we should ask for the judge. The one that you make questions, we should ask for the judge. Okay. Who have different, you know, different organizations, tournaments. Question number one: What is your favorite competitive game mode of any game? So, mi a mi a kedvenc game mode, hogy egy nikitának bármilyen ilyen kompetitív játék van? Like original Stalker, the first one. There was there was a multiplayer in there, and there was like a game mode. I don't remember exact like mechanic, but the case. Tarkovban volt egy eredeti Stalkerben volt egy játék mód. Grab this case and extract it or something. És abban volt egy olyan játék mód, ahol gyakorlatilag egy táskát kellett megfelelni, és ki kellett menned. One, I really liked this, like, small missions in the original Unreal Tournament. Like, it was multiplayer PvE missions. Igen, és hogy a PvE missionek tetszettek neki az eredeti Unreal Tournamentben, amik ilyen sidequestek. Capture the pack. The classic game modes of Rainbow Six. 
És a klasszikus Rainbow Six game mód, amit tetszik neki. Mostly the TV actually, because you have a team and you need to plan things. About like if 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 I just want to relax, I love team team this match and like the team this match. Relax, I'm gonna go team death match. But something like this. I don't I don't like a huge fan of the big scale like combats. Uh, I like I I love more like CQB CQC stuff. Ah, you can't stop. It's a close quarter. So the CQB CQC is because they are too tired to set it in camp. No, it's not better for the other guy. But yeah, no, it's not. 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 Okay. Szerintem igazából több, több helyre lenne szükségük, hogy ezt lehessen a játékban csinálni. Nincs rá elég hely, de, de van rá elég hely. Tehát, hogy meg lehetne oldani. Nem megoldható, de meg lehet oldani. Next question. How confident are you guys in getting a reader mode out this year? Um, I can tell that we are confident, confident, like 100% confident, because again, uh, we are making the streets of Tarkov, and, and it, it's not only. Yeah, just running a mode draw, but okay, just okay, I won. Watch out. Huge pile of uh, uh, mechanics, different kind of stuff, new X fields, and everything, and the, the general network improvement uh, to carry on. You must know, shock me then. The August, the streets are captured. There's more network improvement, the new X fields, the new. Új optimalizációk rendere a kapcsolatosan is. Nagyon sok mindent átdolgoznak éppen. Szóval nagyon szeretnék egyszerűen az Arena módot idén, de legalább csak annyit, hogy, hogy mutassák volna valamit. So you will understand what what you should expect in this game. Like I've asked you yet, but maybe I'm not sure that I'm not sure that it will be completed this year. Nem nem biztos a baj, hogy ez idén kész lesz. Quick question, actually, if you don't mind me asking one, is when when arena mode comes out, do you feel like every competition is going to be like say Twitch Rivals? Are you guys going to only do Twitch Rivals on arena mode, or is it going to be more? Ugye azt mondta a kérdés, hogy Ugye azt mondta ki az arena mód, akkor a Twitch Rival az meg ezek az, azok is ugye arénában menjenek át De azt mondjuk itt, hogy igazából nem probléma Nem probléma nekik az sem, hogy ugye külön játékmódokat csinálnak a, a, a versenyekhez Mint olyan, de egyébként az, abban sem Tehát Azt mondjuk igazából az sem gond, hogyha Ugye ugyanazon a szerven játszik, ugyanabban a game módban játszik, a arena módban, vagy nem arena módban van a verseny tartva. Mindegy igazából. General massive tournament worldwide and with a lot of people uh, with a lot of uh, influence influencers in it. Uh, so it's totally okay if we will have more time in it, uh, we will make uh, some special stuff. We could make it. Igen, ez ugye most ugye a speciális játékmódokról szó beszél éppen, hogy ha esetleg valami Twitch Rivals, vagy valami van versenyhez, vagy kitalálnak valamilyen versenyt, akkor ugye igazából meg tudják oldani, nyilván időbe telik. Érdekli őket a... A, a tornamentek ezek a versenyek, vagy nem? De egyébként igen, azt mondta Nikita. Igen, ez egy prób, perfekt prób for us, that the game is more than just a, like a bunch of pixels, you know, and just like. Igen, és fontos, mondja Nikita, hogy egyébként pont ez a bizonyíték arra, hogy a játék nem csak egy, egy kötek pixel. Game developers product or something, it's it became like culturized, it became massive in terms of. Igen, ugye masszív lett, és gyakorlatilag kultúra épült rá, mint olyan. For for and most of all. Brings not only the joy and like competitive feelings. It brings, I don't know how to say it, like 
Money, I guess. Like the prizes. <laughs> nem, csak, nem csak ugye a, a, ezek a versenyek, ugye nem csak a, a, ezt a joy-t, ugye az élvezetet hozzák meg a, az egészet, hanem ugye a, a pénz, ugye gyakorlatilag ugye a pénz is hoz valamilyen szinten, ezt ne értsétek, hogy rosszul, meg ugye közösséget is épített. A pénz itt az, az azt jelenti, hogy ugye, ugye vannak verseny price-ok, mint olyan. And uh, usually tournaments mm, give us, like the community, a lot of the material, a lot of movies, clips and funny moments and... Uh, so these are the games that give us a lot of new things, like clips, videos, and the matches. And boosting and uh, moving the whole EFT uh, subsystem, subculture forward. And it's really, it's really cool. És azt mondja, ezek a versenyek előre viszik ezt a um, ugye, Tarkov szubkultúrát. Interesting. I want to pick, uh, I want to understand a little bit behind how you came to arena mode. What games influenced you to concept your lives? Szeretném megérteni, Sniki, hogy mi, mi volt a, ugye, az atya az arena mode It was uh, like pretty simple, because again, uh, the FT is a shooter game, FPS game, and I played a lot of games FPS genre and I always wanted to see how it will be with the EFT game mechanics. So it's ah, so like so well, yeah, as a as a young project in Gitana shooter game you sh Alex FPS shayatic is or what can you Ugye a klasszikus FPS-ek az EFT mechanikáival hogyan működnének. Run faster because the location will be smaller, and it will uh, give us again not only us the developers and myself. It will give the EFT community more audience, more players from the different uh, even genres. Even it will. Igen, és ezek az eventek egyébként nagyon nagyon sok információt vannak, hogy adni nekünk is meg sokkal többet fog hozzáadni a mi játékunk, mi játék elményhez és az BSG elményhez is, mint olyan. Transfer, like change. Casual uh, auditory, casual players into even more hardcore players, so it, it's a good thing, actually. It's just atlag játékos, hogy próbálják ezzel majd ugye a hardcore játékokra rápakolni. Warzone megnézni a kommunikával. The idea was roaming around for a long time and uh, it's just, it, it's like, it's natural, I think. And we just, I just thought about it, like, uh, we can't create some really specific strange even uh game modes within the main game but we can do it in the like within yes. the lore like somebody so that you can have a lore on but you're not going to change and then you're not shocked me and the order i'm a free acting one man and that's classic start with one name as a cow you're killing us all as an arena mode you're caught up короче сделать это все как-то более целостно и в рамках такого поствоенного пред апокалиптического мира és egy kicsit ilyen félig mindig ilyen posztapokaliptikusan, de ugye csináljuk meg abban az, abban az ajánlában gyakorlatilag. És az egész lore gyakorlatilag belefér, hogy ugye emberek ugye harcolnak a pénzért, és ez a, a pénz a, a, ugye az életednek az ára gyakorlatilag. How long would an average match last us, do you think? It depends on the game mode. First of all, there is... Medic Tartan is a Atlagos match, so this is a game mode tofu. Like, will require... Like, not require... Like, you will not have an actual ability to play by five. Like, to have five players in your team. Because, again, it depends on the game mode. If you if you will play, like, PvE... Uh, Ah, és nem, nem, nem igazán tudnak erre mit mondani, úgy, úgy, gossz, úgy gondolom, mert ugye nem, nem csak erről a klasszikus 5 v beszélgetünk, hanem ugye a PVR-ről is, mint olyan, PVR módokról is, meg minden más egyébről. Szóval, 
15-20 minutes. Ja, és egy perc és 15-20 perc közé a szél, úgy gondolja ez az átlag idejét egy ilyen meccsnek. Szóval van olyan game mode, vagy van olyan game mode, hogy ilyen egyedülálló, de van olyan, hogy ilyen 2v3, 2v2, 3v3. Is there possibility of then of like custom lobbies or like a spectator mode with this as well? Or is it going to be set? I guess we will make something like this, because... Most ugye a custom lobbyt mondja, amit tudja magadnak ragaszt össze, meg a... A spectator módot, ami ugye, ami ugye gyakorlatilag kötelező ezek az játékokhoz. Ah, és hogy nem igazán tudod erre mit mondani, de valószínűleg lesz valami ilyen, ami gyakorlatilag ilyen coaching, minden más egyéb lesz, szépen negózni. Az is lehet, hogy egy kicsit másabb networking motorja lesz, mint olyan. Aha. És hogy igazából szeretnének ugye minden gyakorlatilag ugye minden olyan elemet belerakni a, ezekbe a kompetíció, vagy ez, ebbe a módba, ami ami ugye ahhoz kell, hogy ezt tényleg versenyképes legyen, úgy gondolom. Egy kamerák, meg más egyéb deskemek. Szóval gyakorlatilag ugye a játék mechanikára próbálnak ráépíteni egy modern e-sport FPS játékot. Gyakorlatilag. Like created in the real life, so we will like think about and uh, make all of the, these features and details as it is as it like could be in real life, and that's the, that's the challenge for us actually to to make it all uh, looking um, solid, like and balanced. I think if you can maybe reveal something that would be very interesting. So. Uh, you have said before that uh, arena mode will be linked to the main Tarkov game. So if you are mm -hmm. getting rewards from the arena mode, mm -hmm. you will most likely be able to transfer some so of it, those rewards to so the main game. So you just want to be able to use the gear that you have in the arena mode. And will you use the gear that you have in the arena mode? And will you use the gear that you have in the arena mode? And will you use the gear that you have in the arena mode? And will you use the gear that this particular feature that after after receiving the special ranking in the game so we use it like the, the this like arena mode will have rankings and it, this there will like be like close to a sports rankings or something so you will need to, to uh, a rank rancert man has open like special like the basic rank so in and this rank will open more possibilities to you for example to use your gear that you can use ah okay so ugye minél, minél magasabb rangod van gyakorlatilag annál um, annál kevesebb ugye a limitációd még gear terén meg egyébként tehát ugye amikor elérsz egy bizonyos rangot akkor ugye használhatod már a saját gearedet például like open class or something so everybody with you will be also using the like their gear or something or uh, there is Like again, it's like the point uh, of like change right now. We are like thinking about it still, but again, um, yes, it will use you, it will use your gear. You will lose it if you will die. But you must understand. Yeah, yeah, it's true. Gear, my horse has true gear. Insurance options over there will work much better than in raids in a typical EFT succession because again, okay. everybody will die actually, <laughs> eventually. Szóval azt mondja, hogy igazából ugye az insurance uh, sokkal jobban fog működni, mint a játékban, vagy ez a biztosítás, mert gyakorlatilag mindenki meg fog halni. Ez 
Ja, és ugye igazából aki hogy az utolsó, aki életben maradnak, nem lesz ideje arra, hogy lootot gyűjtögessen magának. Igen, szóval annak az esélye, hogy, hogy ugye valaki elviszi a cuccot, nagyon-nagyon alacsony lesz, mert nem nagyon lesz arra ideje, ugye gyakorlatilag az arena módból is ki kell, hogy juss. Tehát attól függetlenül, hogy mondjuk te vagy az utolsó, aki ilyenben maradt, hogy ki kell, hogy juss, és nagyon limitált időd lesz. Nem fogják ellopkodni a tudszóra gyakorlatilag, nem fogják tudni elvinni. Nem az ideje. Igen, hogy a skillek át lesznek-e ültetve az arena módra, vagy nem, de erre nem igazán tudom, hogy mondani még. Egyelőre nem tudja. Ez gyors CQB, CQC, ez gyakorlatilag gyors. Tehát nem biztos, hogy minden skill használható lesz, vagy hogy jó lesz. És egyszerűen szívesen beszélek arról a topikról majd, amit ugye feldobtatok Petővel. Skillek használva lesznek, de igazából szerintem fogalma nincsen még arról, hogy a skill rendszerű, amit fogja csinálni, de ezt ő is elmondta, hogy nem tudja még. More and more getting involved with different organizations like, for instance, Sigma's Evasion, um, as well as other regional competitions uh, and organizations. Yes, yes. Does BSG plan to hold BSG only events. Okay, so I must just ask her as he ask her as he sneaky. Hogy um, gyakorlatilag ugye nem titok, hogy uh, BSG támogat egy csomó verseny. És hogy neki állnak a saját versenyeknek. Igazából volt az nekik tervező, de ugye a korona miatt változtatni kellett az ütemtervet. Még egy csomó minden. De ez ilyen igen, talán csinálnak valami ilyesmit. Azt mondja, igazából nem biztos, hogy belevágnak ilyen, mert ugye itt van az Evasion, meg minden más egy évben csomó van ennek is szervez erre, és nem biztos, hogy van rá nekik erőforrásuk. And it's it it helps it helps a lot, but again we we constantly thinking about it, and I think in the future we'll make something big. Maybe it will be some kind of promotional event just just to test it out. Maybe this event will be linked to the release of the big feature or even like the release of the game. Vagy az ilyen évetek valószínűleg ilyen, ilyen promó jellegűek lesznek, tehát vagy a, a játéknak a kiadása, vagy valamilyen nagyobb ilyen játék update-nek a kiadása lesz. System, the way that Tarkov works at this time, I would say that we are, there is a lot of open space and we can definitely do a lot with what we have currently, but at the same time we are also 
uh, somewhat limited with, say, we don't have a respawn system. Mm -hmm. So classic game modes mm. are very difficult to uh, to do within the Tarkov setting right now. Szóval ugye azt mondja, hogy magát a Tarkov van jelenleg ugye nehéz megoldani ezeket a játékban valamikákat, amik ugye más FPS-eknél ott vannak, respawn, meg egyebek. Ugye nincs erre lehetőség most, tehát rengeteg, a, rengeteg dolog van, amit használtak a játékban, de rengeteg limitáció is van a jelenlegi, jelenleg a Tarkovnak, mint olyan. I don't know, because okay. uh, to put in uh, the respawn system, it will break the this uh, how to say. Hmm. Az immersion te gyakorlatilag az egésznek az átélését elnéve meg a respawn system. Kruci. Én most egy orosz. Szíjnyát a borsot, hogy tebe a zsíjny adná, és ti dorni darazít, ez a kreugolni kámin vszió kvá vszié koncepcii. Okay. Если его добавлять, если его добавлять в арену и постоянно будет респаун, ты начнешь стоимость своей жизни, она начнет понижаться. И не хотелось бы этого сделать. Все-таки нужно, чтобы арена, она yes, была страшно, чтобы было очень страшно в нее играть, чтобы это был прям реально выход как на сцену. И ты понимал, я сейчас могу слить за две секунды все, к чему я готовился. Вот okay. должно быть так, а не так. Сдох снова, сдох снова, сдох снова, сдох снова. Let me, let me relay, so... Uh, yes. Nikita just said that the concept of you have a single life and that life is very precious to you, whatever you have on you at time is very precious to you. Um, that is the cornerstone of the game itself. Okay, so that's the biggest, that concept, uh, the biggest thing that he doesn't want that concept to be away. 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 He doesn't want that concept you are scared of losing whatever you've brought in with you within that two seconds and you're not just constantly keep going in and dying and dying and dying and it's not as when you have it by the way my chicken fps now you're called interesting next respawn i agree i agree 110 percent yes as we're going to mindy go as already no more to start to extract so that concept of of the of the value of your life well it's not as already no more to show us what i'm actually that's so yeah yeah that's stand you want to put Start to die often, and just it will just respawn. Your life, your play, play, like the the value of your player, <laughs> like of your character's life, will be lower lowered uh, for that moment that you will like, like realize that you are playing not EFT but a Call of Duty, for example. And it's not the concept and the philosophy even that we have in the game. Tehát igazából ugye a koncepció, meg az egésznek a filozófia nem az, hogy, hogy ugye az legyen, hogy még akkor, hogy itt csináljanak, hanem hogy legyen. Tehát ők, ők külön, külön akarnak lenni ebből a szempontból, az Escape from Tarkov legyen Escape from Tarkov. Lower in terms of like availability of these presets, availability of the different game modes. Yeah, yeah. Presets, I get money. They use a lot of shit. Let's say, I'm even. Bam is. I have to do the stuff. I have to do the content. And it's not good. It will like close the doors, and you will start from again from the low tier, and it will not be cool. And again, like the idea of the arena mode. És itt megint ugye a ranking systemet hozta fel, hogy, hogy visszabesül a ranglistán, akkor, akkor annyi. Ezek megint kevesebb tudszhoz fogsz, fogsz hozzáférni. Megint ugye ezt a ranking per elite per létrehozós témát nyomja. Srácok ne arra gondoljatok, de nem tudom olvasni a csehetőt is egyszerre, jó? Mindent beszéljük meg, ha kíváncsiak vagytok rá, hogy a véleményről beszéljük meg a podcast után, jó? Ugyanígy... So maybe prestige, maybe cosmetics for certain levels. Ah, igen, az ranking system az ugye kozmetik köztutcok meg ilyenek, vagy ez a kozmetik cuccok, skinek meg hasonlók, akármi. 
game. But again, if you have a main okay. game, main account connected to it, uh, you will be able to unlock things, like a lot of things. With these rankings, you will be able to complete some special quests even because again if you will start like playing arena the proper ah yes tam tehát hogy ugye az arena meg az arena meg ugye a tarka ugye össze csak akkor tehát van mint olyan is hogyha valamilyen rankod van akkor éppenséggel lehet lehet hogy lesznek olyan küldetések amiket megcsinálsz ugye a rankodtól függően uh, tarka van belül vagy kaphatsz valami olyan dolgot mozog a fejem még Uh, like questionable and thinkable thing that we need to <clears throat> carry on later. Okay, okay, interesting. I I really like what what we have so far. Do you guys have any, any other questions? Does BSG plan on doing official uh, tournaments for you guys once arena mode or or before that? De lesznek a off ilyen BSG yeah. versenyek, de ezt ugye már megbeszélték, hogy még nem tudjuk. Here's a different one though, with uh, different regions being more and more involved in esports and competitions and other ideas coming up from different regions around the world. Uh, is BSG potentially looking into having official channels for those regions where okay. they would be able Tehát, to host vannak, uh, regional regionális eventek, mint olyan is, ugye azon gyakorlatilag bele, bele nézegetnek abba az opcióba, hogy mi lenne, hogy ezt gyakorlatilag csinálnának egy ilyen versenyeket, ugye ezekkel a csoportokkal együtt. Szóval, hogy igazából a regionális Twitch csatornánkat mondtam most, hogy akár még azt is el tudják képzelni. Oké, perfekt. Will we need to buy arena? Questionable thing, because I stated that you will need to buy it. Even if you have EOD, because again, you must understand the arena will require okay. new servers, additional servers. Uh, development of the arena mode. It all will be developed on the. Szerintem nem biztosak benne, de azt mondta, hogy hogy ha EOD van, és akkor is meg hogy vend. Nyilván szerverek a minden más pénzbe kerül. New servers, high-powered servers, and this will be like the monthly. Payments for the servers, so we must understand that we need to bring some kind of money to operate all of the servers and the tournaments and the localizations and stuff that will be needed for the arena and like related to the arena. Yeah, you mentioned that your business model is not that you have to create a server or you have to build a server, but um, as a separate. That's the answer. What we have to do is that 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 you have to create a separate game for us to play. In other words, that's more than likely a separate game is going to be needed. Yeah, that's the answer. Ну как сказать, что она не questionable, я постоянно говорю questionable, она даже не questionable, она как бы... Кердешеш. А за вас это кердешеш, а суть, а суть физически она, а за ней наверное нам, то есть мы их нам без суток бенна. То, гоно мы то модель ванит, то есть мы алапьян, уж мы делим их, то есть мы алапьян, я за ней грейся. Да кез. We have servers. They need to be like. No, yeah, kids. We have a lot of servers actually, and it like I'm not talking about the salaries and stuff, but I'm talking about the servers that need to be running, and this is the servers need to be special in terms of like the hardware because they need to be like really good. Okay. So, yeah. Yeah. One hundred percent. It will be not free for the standard users, non EOD users. It will be. Ah, tehát 100 százalék az, hogy nem lesz ingyenes, ha nem EOD-val rendelkezőknek. Ah, és valószínűleg egy ilyen, ilyen külön játék lesz, hogy EFT Arena vagy valami ilyesmi. Especially related to your main account, so you'll not be able to use your gear. You'll not be able to use like special items and have quests or something. What is? So it's mainly, mainly on the local media. What's the name? You will not be able to level your skills. I mean, maybe you're just missing. Level your character even. Maybe 
you will be able to level your character, but yeah. it will be limited also. Because again, it's not like we are. A greedy. Greedy, yeah, like greedy. We don't want you to yeah, them come like experience or something. <laughs> but it's all like technically limited, and it depends on the actual the main account, which consists like a lot of different features, like parameters and stuff. Yeah, and uh, we will see how it will go actually. Because yeah, so uh, yeah, my 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 lady goes to the I'm not sure how many of them are going to be Hogy ő most mit mondott, hogy ezen a podcaston gyakorlatilag volt az X, tehát most ez így majd meglátjuk, lesz bőle valami. Megint csak ugyanaz, on the table, it's on the table, being considered, tehát ez a majd, majd kiderül, tehát ezt meglátjuk. Yeah, go on, 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 go Servers, you see everyone be like, ah, just do this to servers, just do this. What do you think is the biggest misconception is that people think that the servers, especially game servers with a high quality hardware, are available. It's so easy just to buy more servers. No, it's not. They are not available all around the world. We can buy yeah, I remember. the St. Petersburg. A lot of servers actually. They are cheap. They, we not, we're not buying it. We're renting them, of yeah. course. Because so it's like beta servers, it's not like that server. Right now. But if you will try to buy in the Middle Eastern area, it's like it's a problem. És egy közel keleten ez egyébként az hatalmas probléma. Azt mondták is, hogy ott valami nem oké. Tehát sokkal többen is kerülnek azok a szerverek, meg a hardware sem, sem éppen ott van. In Europe costs us 100 euro, but for example, 100 euro. In Dubai, it costs us 50 hundreds euro, like 15, 15 times more than. So, but you tell us if I have when you not as good as me. Ha mondjuk Európában mondjuk 100 euró ér vesz a szervert, Dubajban ugyanez 500 euró. We'll need to make but watch out, as it says, it's purchasable for everybody because it will cost us a lot of money, and we need to like go on to go on f- like. F- that's an example of the answer by us. As many as I'm still in Nikita, I mean, I mean, the chance that I'm missing is bigger than that. That as a server building system, that's not many that's a family to get portal, and then that's going to be. Valheim szervert vagy valamit, hanem azok a szervek, amikkel ugye ők dolgoznak, nagyon nagy teljesítményűek, és egyébként nagyon nehezen, el, úgymond ne, nagyon sok, ami nagyon el, nehezen elérhető, mert kevés van belőle. Tehát nem, ezek nem exakt vasak, tehát ez egy másik történet, de hogy nem olyan egyszerű ezeket azért felkutatni, meg az ilyen providereket megtalálni, akik hogy ezzel fog, erre szakosodnak. It's complicated, and that's it. Persze. It's complicated, but people always think that it's not, and we just lazy and stupid. Of course. Igen, tehát ugye mindig úgy gondoljuk, hogy csak lusták és hülyék, de úgy nem, tehát nem erről van szó. Ez tényleg egy valós probléma. Ez, ez egy valós probléma, gyerekek. Utilize everything that we have, and the thing is that it's an innovative process, and nobody understands how it actually could be made in our uh, case and that's why we gather all of the information all of the experience and uh, so probably because you're better than you probably because the dog isn't saying she's not you're gonna get showing you for areas of our expertise we are not stupid already like we are pretty confident and we know what to do that's it Okay. Uh, I have a different question, but it also involves esports and competitions. Right now, a lot of competitions are happening because people, well, you have to have a full stash 
this is a two-barreled and double-barreled question. So people have to have a full stash for a start to participate in competitions. So they have mm -hmm. to have one time investment to be yeah, able so to you can tell the station. And then the second part of it is does BSG plan to maybe slow down the progression for the people who don't necessarily want to take care of, you know, be in competition? So would you consider potentially going around <clears throat> the time investment for people to be able to participate in competitions such as rivals, for instance? Mm -hmm. Or uh, would you slow down progression? So maybe you have two different paths Okay, ez, ez igazából ezt a kérdést nem értem, hogy ezt miért, miért rakta fel, de a kérdés az abból áll, hogy ugye el fogják -e különíteni, hogy mondjuk aki kompetitíven akar játszani, annak még gyorsabb vagy lassabb lesz a, a progress, vagy, vagy aki nem akar kompetitíven játszani, annak gyorsabb lesz, vagy lassabb lesz a progress. So to slower the general progression just for the sake of the tournaments, I think it's not a good idea. De úgy gondolom, hogy egyébként egyáltalán nem, nem jó idea, nem jó ötlet az, hogy csak a versenyek miatt, vagy a versenyekre való felkészülés miatt, meg egyébek miatt így a progress, hogy a játékban azért progresszet lelassítsák. Tehát, hogy még ha nem tudsz végignyomni kvesztekat, nem tudsz úgy szintezni, és többé. Chat is saying gear rentals, Nikita. Gear rental. Gear rent gear. <laughs> bear suits, yeah, like a sneaker, like a chat, just like a bear attitude. Two hours long. It was customs, mainly PvP. Um, but the average, like I was asking the other competitors, myself, I spent 25 million rubles on kits because I die a lot. But other people spent less, or some people spent more. So it's a big time investment in terms of either farming that money or just you know taking the dent on your bank balance to play in these tournaments. Igen, ugye, ugye, hogy azt mondja, Iron Fist is, hogy rengeteg pénzbe kerül gyakorlatilag ezekben a, ezekben a versenyekben a részvét, tehát hogy ugye valami 25 millió annyi gírt gókott el. Ami lehet ilyen mindenféle limitációkat csinálni, mint mondjuk nem használhatsz armort le három felett, és többi. Igen, hogy minden versenyek megvan ugye az alsó, meg a felső limit, hogy mi az a, mi az a minimum, mi az a belépő szint, és mi az, ami mondjuk a teteje lehet. You can add this specific uh, requirements, and the tournament will be more interesting, I, I think, because. Egy, egy, egy csináltunk ilyen, ilyen, ilyen elvárásokat, mint olyan, hogy egy olyan verseny, és ugye ezek azért um, sokkal érdekesebbé tettik magukat a versenyeket, hogy a megadott gírra játszhatsz csak, mondjuk. I said about like open class, closed class. This is like the practical shooting stuff. Like you, you can. Uh, participate with your gear, with your gun, with your customized weapon, and have a lot of things attached. Uh, Igen, most ugye erről az open class-ról, meg ilyenekről beszélt, ezek egy ilyen, ilyen, vagy ez egy ilyen versenylövő uh, zsargon gyakorlatilag, hogy megjelenhetsz a saját utcoddal, de a saját gíred, de minden más egyébben, de az is lehet, hogy olyan lesz, hogy ne szállj itt a pak, és akkor ezzel menjél. But if you will uh, play as like a like closed class or like the basic stock class or something they will be used like only stocked AKs only yeah, yeah, because a stock class is a gyári gyári történt hogy csak gyári gyárgákkal játszhatsz uh, equalized and és ugye ebből a szempontból ugye teljesen ki lesz kiegyenlíthető a a gear különbség more sporty more fair és akkor fairebb meg more meg sport tehát ez a, a nem is sportos ebben a gyerek össze Hold on, Geeksy, we gotta get this <laughs> out of the way. Nikita, can can you just look at the camera and say Iron Fist, just get good. Iron Fist, just get good. <laughs> Clip it and ship well, it, boys. It, it, well, we know Iron Fist has a new alert. Thank you so much, Nikita. <laughs> 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 Ugye ennyit kértek Nikita, csak én, hogy nézzen a kamerába és mondja azt, hogy Iron Fist, get good. I said a lot of exclusive information. I just got it. Like, a lot of exclusive information about the arena. 
but again it's a subject to change and um, i don't know where i don't know when exactly uh, i will give you the actual information because te most kapott egy csomó jó infót egyébként a, az arénáról, mint olyan, de nem, nem tudjuk, mikor fogja megosztani velünk. De a specifikusabb információt, hogy bőve információnak később kapunk, de nem tudja mikor. Köszönöm szépen. 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 És hogy elvezi az ilyen beszélgetéseket, hogy végre valami, valami újról kell beszélni, nem arról, hogy amikor lesz VoIP, meg izé, meg ez, meg az, meg az. Tehát... Dissink és cheaterek. We picked the best of uh, of the best, and the rest of the questions you have answered many times, uh, which we will go over in our own time. So don't worry about it. Thank you so much for your time. It's been an Thank absolute you. pleasure. Um, Thank you, guys. Uh, the last thing that I want to say say that uh, um, actually I said enough. Az utolsó dolog, amit mondani akartam. Inkább még. <laughs> Ladies and gents, that was Nikita. Get some hearts going in chat for the the man, the myth, uh, the legend. It's always great to see the man, the myth, the legend. Does us not only his time, but uh, some of the information that I mean, only he has because it is his concept. Tarkov is his is his baby, um, and he he has to you know be very careful, of course, with what he says. Um, but he has definitely said a lot today in just a very short amount of time. Yes, we did. Yes, Nikki. Yes, yeah, Tarko was was Nikki. Tényleg, tényleg, nem egy gyerek. Ebből a szempontból, tehát, ugye az egész koncepció az ő, az egész, gyakorlatilag minden az ő fejéből pattant ki. És hogy, ugye nagyon sok mindent megkaptunk, információt, nagyon sok új információt kaptunk most, de az én nagyon, ugye figyelni kell arra, hogy. Hogy, hogy, hogy ugye mikor, hogy miket mond, és mondjuk most, most pont az a röhögnek, hogy ugye mikor lesz a következő vibe, ami jövő egy csütörtökre. Jövő egy csütörtök a következő vibe, gyerek. Trollkodnak persze, csak, csak trollkodnak. Szóval mindannyi négyen nem is szerik, vagy ilyen nagykövetek, de hogy miből áll az egész, ezt nem tudja valaki, vagy nem. A lila név a lobbyban. Well, we're not, just, we're not just like <laughs> customer support. <laughs> um, I, like, I like to th- I, I like to think of emissaries. The best way I, I I try to explain it to people is we're the bridge between the community and BSG. You know. Yes, so you got to get the emissary in turn. Yeah, a community. The closest is the BSG because of the heat. And then we kind of hash things out. We talk about things, and then maybe you know, then we'll mention it to someone else who will bring it to BSG's attention. Yeah. So. Ah, yeah. Szóval, ha van valamilyen ötletetek, vagy valami egyéb, vagy egy emissary, vagy megbeszéltek, abból lehet, hogy igazából eljut a BSG-ig, mint olyan. Köszönöm at least like the most up to date information on a lot of what is happening in Tarkov because we do have centralized uh, channels of information where we can compile things we can definitely see what is going on in the general community um and it's uh, it's just a lot easier for us what is happening what are the general hot topics and to of course have those answers for you Um, ugye, ugye, ezek, mi, mik azok a hot topikok, mik azok az, a, 
a, a forró témák ebből a szempontból, amiről ugye tudnak, és elég sok mindent tudnak róla, és hogyha ez, ehhez van esetleg infotok, vagy valami, akkor azt ugye el tudjátok juttatni nekik, mint olyan. Vannak ugye regionális emiszerek. A cheater téma. It's interesting because we still do a lot in the background, not only just to collect information, but to, of course, also do something about that information. And hey, that does involve, say, reporting, uh, for instance, you know, cheated discords and things like that, um, you know, directly to to discord because, hey, we've got to keep keep the streets or the servers as clean as as we can. So do you get a cheater team? I'm going to show you as well. No, sure, man. Nagyon sok mindent csinálnak, hogy vizsgálják tényleg a cheater discordok, vagy a reportok, minden más, hogy egyéb infogyűjtés. Hasonló. Szia. Ó, egy kis jó, jó kis mitoszírtás lesz most. Ez jó, ez jó lesz. Streamer, emissary, sherpa, server, privilege. Streamer, emissary, sherpa, server, privilegium, gyerekek. Azt tudod, hogy X-nek rengeteg van. Tehát, hogy ugye a kis sárpa, meg streamer, meg más egyéb vannak, akkor szerver jut. Ez nem igaz. If you're joining the program for the sake of those rewards, you're joining for the wrong reason. Yeah. Because the amount. Nem is tudom, hogy van bármi, hogy egyébként kap kapjuk a sherpák. Tehát egy ugye, azt mondja, a sherpa programnál ugye vannak targetek, amiket ugye úgy van tartani kell, hogy érdemes megütni, és akkor azért ugye kapsz valami a rewardokat. Fogalmam nincs, hogy mikor rewardok. Here's a fancy name tag. Here's some free stuff. Yeah, it's not like every Tuesday they're like, ah, it's the case Tuesday. We'll just throw a couple of them out. Yeah, no. That's not how that works at all. At all, at all. So if you are potentially thinking of either becoming a Sherpa or an emissary, um, I will tell you now that a lot of the time, again, it's just you're not not a reward or care. Do get picked and do get accepted into those programs. They already do. In most cases, they already do what an emissary or a Sherpa does. Anyway, without having the tag, without having. Tehát ezek a kis sherpa, meg 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 emissary programok, hogy bekerülnek, az általában már ugye csinálják azt, amit egy sherpa vagy egy emissary csinál, csak ugye nem kapod meg a teget. They really do not exist. Yeah, sure, there might be some rewards for especially sherpas, but I mean, as an emissary, I don't know. I've played the game for so long. I'm comfortable with a stash of. Like if I have six hundred thousand in my stash, I'm I feel as if it's ten million. I took the hundred million. It doesn't matter to me how much money I have. Money means absolutely nothing to me. Yeah, that reward of playing game, reward of having fun. Maximum. It is about using what you have to, you know, in your possession that you can use in order to get through the raid. Everybody plays right. different. Én mindenki más kép játszik, ezt kell szóta, hogy igazából nem zavarja, hogy mennyi van a stash-é mentet. Igen, és ugye egyik sincs ingyen, tehát mindig meg kell dolgozni. And it's, I mean, it's a bit of a sharp question or like a bit of a sharp topic, but BSG doesn't want to get better servers or they make millions and don't care. Kezdődik. Szóval, hogy a BSG nem akar jobb szervereket is, hogy csak pénz nyeri az egész, meg izője, meg minden más. Ez a klasszik, klasszik, amit mindig mindenki tovább. BSG nem akar új szervereket. Igen, tehát ez, uh, ugye itt most minden, ami fel van téve, mint kérdés, ez ugye szarkasztikusan van fel téve, mint egy kérdés, srácok. Meg megint ugye a BSG megint nem akar ugye cheatereket bannolni, tehát ezek mind ugye szarkasztikus kérdések, tehát ezek nem, ez egyik sem igaz. A BSG próbál ugye a, a cheaterek ellen tenni, Nikita elmondta, hogy próbálnak szerveket, hogy többször elmondta, hogy egyébként egy hét alatt gyakorlatilag. Nikita elmondta, hogy többször 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 elmondta, h
that he doesn't play the game very often because it is incomplete. And in his current state, yeah, sure, it's incomplete, but further down the line, they actually want to play the game themselves. Do you think that BSG wants to play on servers which are igen, tehát a szerverek, meg minden más egyéb. Tehát, hogy aki ugye a BSG-nél dolgozik, nem túl sokat játszik a játékkal, mint olyan. Mert ugye nincs kész, dolgoznak rajta nyilván, de hogy ők sem szeretnének, amikor ez ugye kész lesz, ők sem szeretnének majd ugye egy olyan szerveren játszani, ami deszinkes, hogy nem jó vagy rossz, hogy bármilyen más egyéb, illetve ami tele van cheaterekkel. And they spend so much time working on this, so much time. So when somebody comes to my chat and they're like, immediately jump into, oh, there's just cheaters everywhere. Well, maybe you're, you know, ugye az, right one person. Az amit, az amit ugye Sigma is elmond, hogy rengeteg, rengeteg, rengeteg időt fetszölt már ebben maga a BSG. Ugye egy időben, hogy kaptátok ezeket a riportokat is, hogy mennyit, mennyit, hány embert taptak ki. Come with the solution of, well, just buy more servers, you know? Surely that can fix the problem, just throw money at it. Or they're skimping, buying cheap servers or something. A lot of people. No, it's 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 ők sem támogatják ezt, ugye nyilván ugye uh, ők sem szeretik a csítereket, mi sem szeretjük a csítereket. És szerintem egyre kevesebb is van. And I think it's frustrating for new players, and it's easier. Yes, no, no, I'm kind of saying that you're more cheater, or cheater. Cheater rather than it's a you got outplayed, or you just you yourself played really terribly. But it, but it's like that. Yeah, so just what, what you just he had to talk, or it's like that. So you just had to roll. Especially a shooter. So if you come into this game thinking it's a shooter, and that's all, it's. It's so much more, right? Like the what ammo are you using? What's your skills? You know, do you know your location? Yeah, rengeteg, rengeteg minden van a játékban, tehát rengeteg minden ami ami tovább függ a játék. I mean, whilst we're on the topic, we still do have a few points that we definitely should go over. Um, PSG doesn't do hardware bans. Uh, if you've ever heard of hardware ban or hardware ID ban, it's a bit of a valorant thing. I'm telling you now that that's definitely not true. Um, a hundred percent not. Not true. There is different ways that they that they do that, and they definitely stay on top of it whenever things do come around that change the game, so to speak, uh, in terms of uh, the actual kind of like the way that cheats work and stuff. Um, so don't worry about it. They definitely do hardware bans or so hardware ID bans. One hardware ID ban, gyerekek. Um, so don't worry about it. Please hardware ID ban, na nek egyébként igen. Make sure that you use. The report function in game. If you use the report function, it doesn't work. Report in any way you can to potentially. Ugye a launcherben vagy éppen in gameben. Your emissary. Vagy ha mondjuk van, ha nem működik a launcher vagy valami egy év, nem tudod másképp reportálni, akkor keresünk egy sherpát egy egy emissarit vagy valaki akit ismersz és segít segíteni fog neked. Myself or anybody who is on this cast. Any emissary, we need as much information as possible so that we can take that information seriously. Okay. Yes, we need to be informed about the weather mix. Okay. Please, and all the nekünk vagy adni nekik. I was on, you know, the east. On that, on that, but not that day. The other day, and I think I got killed by a cheater on shoreline. I was in a daytime run. I've had that happen so many times. Because the, the, yeah, the night, the day, the tag up, tag up, I went to my raid, but shoreline on night, because I'm what, valami, yes, my god, the cheater, that does not really do anything. I need much more evidence to support what you are saying. A lot, yeah. Yeah. So if you have. You know, if you feel like you've been cheated, you need to compile the evidence as much as possible. What would evidence be then? 
uh, know, video you know, evidence in, in the most part where the raid code is visible and it has to be as fresh as possible. So that I can actually actually one of my issues, because video will provide me a new role, and we will not take a raid code, and we will be sure to make it fresh as possible. In-game name registered to the person involved, the server ID, a brief description of the interaction, a clip and video or screenshot, which also includes the nickname. And again, make sure there's a report done in game as well. Yeah. So, uh, again, that yeah, legyen egy, legyen róla egy so clip vagy videó, hogy valami. Uh, hard, uh, legyen menne a server ID, ami úgy, hogy a bal alul látjátok, legyen ott a neve. Um, igen. A, an effective report so that we can then be effective about it. Um, which actually leads me on to, on to the next one. Um, how does the anti-cheat work? I don't think we're going to cheat. Know how that that even happens. Um, in fact, not we we don't really even know down to a T. You know, we don't know a hundred percent how it works. Uh, for instance, band waves. Why is there a band wave? Why are there like band waves? You know, all of a sudden, we got so many people or whatever. The anti-cheat actually works twenty-four-seven. It is constantly looking. És ez a Digit 21 per hétben dolgozik, tehát ez... Ez all the servers, every single one, uh, all the time, every single raid, it is constantly scanning, it is looking for uh, potential breaches, code injections, and that kind of thing. Um, so, Igen, egy csomó ilyen cheating technikát ugye néznek folyamatosan, a riportokat is hozzávetik. Over a certain period of time, um, to where people, you know, a certain amount of cheaters has been banned or accounts has been banned and here this is the status report for the time being but the work is ongoing all the time I used to run an ARMA 3 server for 300 people I know how to ban cheaters um, yeah a server with 300 people is completely different to a worldwide igen, és egy most volt egy ilyen arma, arma szervert adott fel, jó, hát 300, 300 playerünk volt, tudjuk, hogy ki a cheater, tudjuk bannolni, tehát ez nem ennyire egyszerű egy, egy, ilyen, egy ilyen globális architektúrán, mint ez. Teljesen más. Teljesen más állatfaj. Before and I I know how this works. Again, I I can't believe they have. They could be could go better lie. Again, I get them every single raid. And that's why I'm just bringing this as our own most important thing. I have to. I've I've actually personally been in in several different situations where I've had to calm people down and explain that like look this this isn't this isn't how it. In this sneaky thing, I'm not a kid. 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 And understand how how the system works in order for everybody to be kind of you know on the same page um, about that. Does that make sense? I hope it does. Um, here's another good one. Um, vigilante groups. That's it. That's igazságos to csoportok. Vigilante groups. Have you heard anything about this? Yeah. I haven't. How does the guy end up? I mean, that's the issue. Iron and I. Yeah, Iron and I have definitely, we've definitely encountered a few actually. Uh, there's some outstanding ones, um, but vigilante groups are essentially a group of people who get together in order to mass report cheaters. Ah, so as a kind of article, you must report on our personal opinion. I don't think it's a good thing. Even if the internet is good, it is. It is the outcome. There's so many things that can go wrong. There is. You know, I think we need we need fair amount. You have to really be careful in how you curate the information that you get before you make a mass report. Not only, but making mass reports. It, I think. Puts a strain on the system. It makes it difficult for the system. Yeah, that's why mass support is even more difficult than than the system. Because it's a a a normal system. It's a 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 system.
Also uh, er begonnen hat, war. Nothing that's never cheated before. So, um, yes, the idea might look. Szóval ne, hogy valaki azt találsz, aki de ha soha nem cheated, akkor az lehet, hogy nem, nem oké. One slip in the whole system uh, will start to fail, and that's not good. That is when we get into into trouble. So please, for the individual, please. You yourself, personally, yes, you, the guy that's playing Tarkov, make sure that you report. Again, it's the other kind of Tarki, Tarki, Yatso, Tarki, Tarki, when you cheat at a Tarko stat. No, that let it Terry Porter, let you do. The Terry Porter, the Massacre, the Ne, the Aki, where your problem had turned. Elő tetsen, ne keressél segítséget más csoportoktól, meg ilyenektől, hogy mass reportoljatok, mert sokkal, és nem biztos, hogy te látod, hogy mi történik a túloldalon, és lehet, hogy egyébként több kárt okoz, amit hasznod. Ha látsz egyet, akkor report, aztán következő next case. This game to be cheater free, but at the end of the day, also there's always going to be cheaters in every game. You know what I mean? I know they're trying to clean up the streets. They're like. Yeah, that does it. The two you can always probe because you're going to be edgy. Probe because you're going to be a redhead. There's no need for it. There's no need for it. Minden minden ilyen online játék van lesznek cheaterek. Tehát nem nem tudsz minden ki játszani. It comes from a place of frustration for the people who do run into either the same cheater or similar names or somebody who's. You know, they look at the 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 name in the launch in the in game, and they see it's a high level, which they they say, oh, it hasn't been banned in a long time. It comes from a place of frustration, and I think the main thing to do is is not waste your own energy on it, whether that's mentally, physically. Yes, I don't think that's what you're saying. I'm not. The frustration. I can't get the frustration. The boss sent for more. Going through the correct channels, reporting it yourself. A report or anything else in case you guys are more. I'm going to take care of it because I want to create a full menu. And family report them. A very tough hit, lad. In an attempt to, you know, mass report them, it it really isn't healthy for yourself. And that that's me speaking from my own experience. When you start becoming obsessed and you watch and you say, "Are they banned yet?" and you 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 run into them again, but you just have to move on. It's part of the game, part of most online games, honestly. Yeah, yes, sure, sure. Yeah, the online game thing is more easy. I'm just not too sure. What's going on? 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 And like, if you mass report people constantly, there I think is a feature with with Battle Eye that makes it so your opinion weighs less now, right? Like you're. Yes, so the Battle Eye now, as it one idea, when you mass report us, maybe you're not going to get that. Because the TV image, you're not going to get that. Because the TV image, you're not going to get that. Because the TV image, you're not going to get that. Because the TV image, you're not going to get that. Because the TV image, you're not going to get that. Because the TV image, you're not going to get that. Because the TV image, you're not going to get that. Because the TV image, you're not going to get that. Because the TV image, you're not going to get van benne csíte. Uh, és ugye, akkor megint csak le fog szavazni maga a betalai rendszer, meg hogyha mass reportoltak, akkor is a mass reportot sem fogja biztos, hogy komolyan menni. If they run run into a certain person, oh, Shemin in Chen. I'm going to Geeksy every day. I'm reporting him. I'm I want him banned. You know, my rhyme reports become nothing because you know my my. This is Shemin Shemin in Chen. Mega rich shit. Why mean I'm mad? Shit, yeah, but false reporting basically. Yeah, yeah, it's a false reporting thing. What that? When you report all that random people, that man, man, I'm not sick. Man, I'm not even Geeksy. Geeks nem tetszik éppen neked, akkor bereportolom. Ugye erre is azt mondták, hogy igazából hallottak ilyet, hogy van olyan, hogy gyakorlatilag a false reporting után már, már te kapod a bant. Ha jól értettem. Vagy, vagy nem, hogy te kapod a bant, de hogy nem, nem fogja a szavazatodat... Tenni. Yeah, but I think it's been good. It's oh, yeah. been really good. Yeah. Uh, vége, vége felé vagyunk már most Actually, a kasznak. One of the better changes for uh, 1210 is that you can no longer change your name uh, as often as you could previously. So that's actually a really 
like a really interesting one for uh for people who can do potentially you know uh be it was used. two weeks previously what's it now i, I well, didn't yeah, actually see that change now? Yeah, I didn't see it either. Yeah, I'm not sure what the what the kit to, but kit it looks like the problem I think uh, from the two weeks that we originally had. I smacked all the things in over that. Um, kit hit well, I'm I take them to Jack and many that time it hit. Um, Even though it's not on topic, there's something I did want to address as well with 1210. Um, it's quite uh, as you said, it's a hot topic with the ghost audio, ghost steps. Mm -hmm. Um, if you do come across it, um, it'll be really helpful if you a did a bug report and made a note of the ticket number. Then, if you clipped it with a note of the raid code, send all that information over um, either to myself, but of myself and a few of the other emissaries we're making a, a bigger report for BSG to compile. Okay, so a ghost report got this. Iron Fist is not good yet, okay? So, let them be. Let them be clipped. Let them be. Ah, what you make? A raid raid code. Some people aren't running into it, but if you are, then. Um, going through again the necessary channels to uh hopefully rectify it before it gets reverted again would yeah. be good yeah okay um i think so, uh, if there is something specific yeah we'll probably talk about it but uh well um look i wanted to actually ask you uh you guys some of the questions that i asked nikita as well um geeks like to kind of loop back to the whole competition esports type thing because mm -hmm, i think mm -hmm. it'll be really interesting to uh i've t spoken to a lot of the community about their perspectives and you know there's some of their favorite game modes but how about you geeks let's start with you in terms of your favorite competitive game modes. Yes, Okay. Like I was huge Halo Three, Halo Reach. Halo. A lot of team deathmatch. That was like my Halo is TDM. Uh, yeah, team deathmatch. We could win that game. Totally forgot about, and that was terrorist hunt in Rainbow Six Siege, uh, or in Rainbow Six Vegas. Rainbow Six Vegas was terrorist hunt. So much fun. Like I, I'm not going to lie to you. I was really hoping he was going to add something like that in arena mode, like. Like almost like a Gears of War wave based. Uh, 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 but um, though, like, yeah, I, I like that kind of style. Like, I, I like a lot of PVE, you know, horde mode kind of things. It's, yeah, horde the mode. Or a as a horde mode. Uh, yeah. Give me zombie mode in Tarkov. Give me no, zombie mode love, in Tarkov. I would love zombie mode Tarkov. Oh yeah. Dude. I would love it. Love it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, uh, sorry, Sigma. How about you? Um, give me. I, I know that you are like relatively recent to. Uh, to gaming so you played you got sigma sigma is it the num num jelly coro to acting to um i played splatoon that's where that rifle is like okay. from it's from that game that sits behind me um, just lot won't get to for going to the anti game even tried warframe for a hot minute geeks and i talked about that the warframe at this yet version you know once i started playing tarkov like that was it so then i had tarkov is not crazy i did i did miss horde mode on interchange that like, i wish that would have never gotten fixed because a random you know horde of scavs that won't stop chasing you down was actually a lot of fun so yeah horde mode that you want to interchange is just kind of fun yeah it would be it would be a blast right you have to you have to scavenge things while other people are covering you so you can get more ammo and you're yeah. using this garbage ammo yeah you think you want that ever sample well yeah yeah left for that yeah like i got um what about you um iron some of your favorite game modes from any game. Anything can, like, to talk of. competitive, I mean, I played, yeah. Yeah, I mean, Insurgency has some good game modes when it comes to uh, competitive, if you've ever played. It started off as a, as a Steam, uh, sorry, like a Valve mod, but then they went standalone. Yeah, so Insurgency, I mean, Valve mod, uh, like, mod can so endure. Capture in, capture the flag type. She, in capture the flag, yeah, it's like a game mode. Like, like, as Insurgency, man. As in-depth as Tarkov, but I feel like in terms of the movement and squad play, I think there's a, a few parallels you can draw there, for sure. Okay, okay. Um, I honestly, um, 
there's a, there's so many questions that I could ask you guys, and we can sit here and uh, and talk about Tarkov until the end of far um, our favorite game. Even though I myself I'm playing a lot of DayZ currently, but uh, regardless, I'm still very much in touch with the with the community, um, and I a lot of the community knows me, and a lot of I know a lot of them, um, and it's just it just is what it is. Um, I don't know, I'm just taking a little bit of a break to come back uh, stronger and better than ever. Um, yeah, sneaky, so, you, you say so. Yeah, like, be beugrál, kiugrál gyakorlatilag, de um, egyre, egyre um, jobban jön visszafelé. Yeah, for sure. Breaks. I don't think anyone here ever, I don't think anyone should ever feel guilty taking a break from a game. Yeah. Like, Igen, mert néha néha azért yeah. érdemes egy kis szünetet um, tartani a játékból. Almost four years at this point of you know talk of every single day Négy év tarkov minden nap az irány. We can all understand where that um Húzós. where a person would be after that much time. Um but anyway. Um and that's the other thing, like if you are like feeling that burnout, go look up some community events or evasion or one of these other Yeah, hashtag like in, in burnout yeah like you I just said I think we're gonna say you can't burn out from it. Uh yeah, I guess the key who can actually take more than one of event that would value you to fast for shit. And if you're you know it switches things up, it keeps things fresh for you and fast for shit now shook me in the each one. Yeah, absolutely. In fact, um there is going to be a lot of competitions. For instance, Sigma. Just give me some numbers. No. Give me some numbers uh, just from your organization specifically. So we actually moved a couple events around. We have 47 events in four months, but we even a little bit. So season middle. won't actually end until the very beginning of July now. Uh, and if so you want to be on the you know, we have a full calendar of events on evasion.gg, that's our website. And right now we have mm -hmm. the NA Duo application open. Um, it, this is a lot of people in the European Union, and a lot of other people's events have. If I could encourage the community to do anything, it would be go get involved in these events, whether you're helping out behind the scenes, because we all know that my events cannot go off without the help of, you know, a ton of people on evasion um but that's the same for all these other events and go help behind the scenes or get involved and and jump in one i i think it's really important probably to get this event together and everything like we should go catch any event then the same crap same day same complaints you know yeah um, personally i know that the italian french cup is actually going to be taking place on the 17th of next month because it is still the 31st where mm, I am so April 17th can less uh, of as as well as Francia uh, <laughs> competition of next month that's in uh, I mean, yeah, not three, just less than three weeks um the Italian French Cup uh will be will be played and I believe it is actually going to be cast um on the main BSG page by myself as well as a wonderful co-caster who goes by the name of Just Kilo for the time Aww. being this is a uh, ah, so a a caster like our that the other version of BSG like a Twitch Twitch order now for Magellani Sneaky is Kilo for Ganka or Just Kilo for Ganka or Jakotaga your comment that you're not now it is it is a lot of work and it is being hosted by some great people you see uh enzo there in chat um definitely keep uh, an eye out for that as well as other regional competitions uh, again like delta's uh competition more events from uh from skewy um and and others one of the best places i think to um to see uh, this type of information uh is again this chat, for instance, right now you got Skewy in the chat. You have, of course, uh, uh, yes, Skewy as a, um, a name. As well as, name at first, you know, the series of um, your specific region. You may be able to ask them information about different things that are happening um, globally. These events are truly, truly, truly great. Yeah, I can't yeah, highlight that anymore. Really, they really are. Truly, truly great. You should tune in to those 
uh, those tournaments. Uh, Legalább próbál, legalább próbáljátok meg megnézni ezeket a, ezeket a tornamenteket, mint olyan ezeket a versenyeket. Keep in touch with uh, with us and your local community managers, whatever it is, your emissaries, um, maybe your sherpas. I don't know. I think there's uh, I think there's some there might be some sherpas involved in. There's always sherpas involved in different competitions. Always, because they are some of the best players. It was Delta's uh, resurgence tournament. It was called Kill Confirmed, so the premise was. Tegnap volt ugye a van, de hát ennek az egyik ilyen versenyem, hogy Resurgence nevet kapta, ez így ilyen Kill Confirmed, ugye a tegeket kell gyűjtögetni. So yeah, surviving is is impossible. So yeah, it wasn't well, it wasn't a good day, you know. Yes, <laughs> it <laughs> So yeah, this is not what not what you want to ask about. That's in terms of having a bit of an investment and having like a full stash. Um, if there's a way to circumvent that, you know, with that's potentially mode, yeah, that's arena mode. that is you know, arena well, mode. Yeah, that, yeah, that's all. That's entirely arena. Again, today, as you can see, we're almost making making it. Yeah, as arena mode, we're making it. Um, Delta, they're all in the chat, so yeah. just click on their name and throw them a follow. Absolutely. That's all you have to do. That's it. Delta, they're going to be all in the mode, and you're going to be They've all got Twitters, they've all got Discord communities. Always stay in touch. Absolutely. Definitely Green sure versus purple. That. Oh, that check. I, I'm down. <laughs> I love that. Emissaries versus Sherpas, what do Let's you go. think? No. Let's go. What do you think? Back, right back now, back yeah. Maybe. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> service. Let's go now. Jó, de emi szerűk a serbeg jelen. Nyomjuk is egyba. I like it. Pew, pew. Oh, sorry. No, no, sorry, guys. We forgot to ask what color armband Nikita wears. If you want to play Tarko. Ah, you got your effort to make it. He did say, no, he said, he's actually stated this before. Mi an armband that hoard Nikita? On Twitter. He's definitely, in fact, he was live streaming on Instagram when he got asked this question. And he did say that he would pick white. Just the white uh, armband. Fair uh, armband, uh, What the color armband is actually worn by the Russian special forces primarily because it is easier to distinguish, and it's just mm. so happy. It's the Russian guys. All the colors are just fair. That's why they're very easy to distinguish. For white, um, I don't know. That's just. I guess that's just. Just how it is. Uh, in any case. Um, All right. Do we have anything else that we need to that, that we need to talk about, discuss? Oh, so I'm gonna watch that call podcast. Like we got everything. I think so. Yeah. Of course, a huge, huge, huge shout out to all of the live translators. Chat, go and uh, go and give the people who are in my chat currently uh, all of those links. Um, are different regional translators which help out a huge, huge ton. Um, yeah, it's just yeah, uh, a a for the progress you know, letting people understand and be more involved with the greater community. Um I thank you for the see, follow, Shani. Uh is definitely a two-way blessing for for everyone. Um definitely make sure that you go and check out those channels. Yes, you check out the community. Naked. They are all speak of course. Yeah, no, hang on. <laughs> languages which are in the chat. Uh they all have their own communities. Please, please go and support them. Go and show them some love. Um, and stick around. I, you may not know who they are, but they are wonderful people. And yes, they yeah, mindenki tudja arra, arra ösztönöz Sneaky, hogy ugye nézzétek meg ezeket a csatornákat, ahol ugye akik ugye fordítanak, mert hogy mindenki egyébként állítanak, még én is nagyon nagy királyság, nagyon jó arcok, és egy kicsit lámpalázás ők most. És egyébként nagyon sokat dolgozunk nyilván ezen, hogy közösségnek nyújtsunk valamit. It is time. I think it is Vége. time. Um, Vége. Vége. Of course, if you've got any questions, whatever it is, make sure that you comment. Um, I will. This will most likely go up on YouTube at some point. But um, if you do have anything specific, please feel free to either message me directly or any of the people who uh, you see on your screen right now, or even the translators. They are also a good way to get in touch with us. As well as uh, BSG and yeah, uh, yeah, uh, yeah, 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 yeah,
Thank you all for sticking around and watching. It's been an Csak köszönjük szépen, hogy itt voltunk, és ennyi lesz szerintem a vége. Thank you, Nikita. Köszönjük Nikita, hogy itt volt. Thanks everyone coming by, saying hello. Thanks guys. Yeah. All right. Well, let's uh, let's send her on home. So Sounds that's... good, boys.